In this video, I tell you the difference between the COP and efficiencies by using different 3 to 4 points. Okay, now when you study the refrigeration air conditioning system, you find out the performance and it is called the COP. Then when you calculating the performance of the IC engine, pump and compressor and turbine, then you find out the efficiencies. Why we are using this different name for the same things. The COP means it is also output upon input, efficiency is also output upon input. But why it is using these different terms that is clear in this video. Now the first point is that the energy is a two type of any device that is a transfer the energy or convert the energy. Okay. The COP is find out for this device with transfer the energy. And efficiency is used to find out the convert the energy. Okay. So suppose I telling about that the coefficient of performance is find out for refrigeration system. In that what we are doing? We are transferring the energy from the room to the surrounding and surrounding to the room. Okay. And in efficiency we convert the energy that is mechanical energy is converted in hydraulic energy and it is also converted into the pressure energy. Okay. So when we transferring this energy from the room to the surrounding a room to the atmosphere that it's called as the COP of performance and COP is generally used for refrigeration and air conditioning system efficiency is used for another purpose and another point is that in the refrigeration system suppose you like this then subscribe my channels and like the video second point is that the in the refrigeration system we find out COP okay and in refrigeration system we supply the high grade energy High grade energy is the work energy. Okay, the work energy is one form of the high grade energy. So it's a high grade means it's complete conversion of energy is possible. Okay, when the complete conversion is possible, that means its performance is more than hundred percent. Okay, so work energy is completely converted in heat energy according to the thermodynamic law. Then the work is completely converted, and suppose we find out the efficiency for the refrigeration system, then what we get the answer that answer is the more than 100 percentage and it is not possible according to the things that the efficiency of the any device is 100 percentage that's why we are not finding out the efficiency for a refrigeration and air conditioning systems efficiency is find out for the heat is the low grade energy okay so we're talking about the ic engine in ic engine we supply the heat energy so heat energy is low grade energy the complete conversion is not possible so an output for the IC engine is the work energy. So it, the work energy is always lower due to the heat energy losses into the systems. Okay, so when we supply the work energy to the system, then 100% work is possible. Okay, conversion is possible. So in the refrigeration system, we supply the work energy to the compressor. That work is converted into the heat energy. Okay, so that's why it's uh, possible to the achieving more performance that we are not using the efficiency term for the refrigeration and air conditioning system. If you learn something then subscribe the channels. Next point is that the COP of the VCR system is always greater than 1. Okay. And if we convert the COP into the term of the efficiency then its answer is the 150 percentage efficiency 200 percentage 350 and 400. Okay, so it's violate the rules of thermodynamics. That's why we use the term COP. And efficiency is less than 100 percentage. If you learn, then subscribe the channel. Next point is that the COP is used to find out performance of refrigeration and air conditioning system and heat pump. Efficiency is find out for majorities of component that is engine, pump, compressor, turbines and any other devices. Thank you for watching this video. Like the video, subscribe my channel and share with friends.